going to do because my only hope to come back to this beautiful country is this man over here and my lawyer that's been working with me pro bono. Just so devastated that we couldn't even get the Trump administration to work on this particular case with a military spouse who has done everything to help with this, helping her husband service to our country. Her husband, Timo, served in the Marines in Iraq, in North Africa, while she was at home, on the home front, raising two lovely young women who you see here today. What justice does this serve? My mom is a good person, and she's not a criminal, so guys. <laughs> ICE for the last five years, they know about her. She reports on supervision. They say, how are you doing? They check her criminal record. She doesn't have a criminal record. And they say, okay, have a nice time. Go back and, and help raise your U.S. citizen children. So ICE knew the right thing to do. I don't think, I don't have any criticism of ICE other than, I don't know, perhaps they could just ignore the directive for zero tolerance and have some tolerance for people like this. Hopefully there'll be a, uh, a correction uh, in that instruction, or this is not going to be the last case like this. So.